Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Pembroke Pines, Florida, with the moron known as Joey Surreal Camera, as he attempts to film the local city hall, but he's denied access to... Well, the secure parts of the building, and, uh, well, as usual, he wants to be uh, nothing more than a gigantic man-child about it. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. File public records request here. No problem. I need your ID. We'll send you up to the fourth floor to file it. I, my government ID? Your driver's license, yes, sir. I don't have one of those. Oh, you don't have one? No. All right. Um, so I, well, to come in a public building, I got to show ID? So this is it's not how it works. So this, so let me help you out here. Go ahead. Let me help you out. So the third floor and fourth floor, okay, is a lot of floors. We can send you up with no problem. Okay. And I don't have a problem even helping you out and sending you up. I appreciate your demeanor. I'm going to have to get someone to help you out to walk you up. Now, Joey, as much as we've seen you driving around, don't tell me you don't have a driver's license. Oh, come on now. You're breaking my heart right here, as well as breaking Florida law if you don't actually have one. Yeah. Because it's just the policy of the But state. is it not public? Is it open to the public? Yeah, the fourth floor is, but... What's on the second? The second floor is the event center. Oh, cool. This is all the event center. I, this is a, building is amazing. Yeah. It's yeah, huge. Yeah, I've never yeah. been to... This is City Hall, right? Yes, sir, Bro, is. never seen a city. My people are going to be, like, freaking out out of this shit. But this, I, oh, want to go up and get a public record well, well yeah i just want to take i just want to take a look around and take some video as well no that, that's it I, i'm still thinking about the public records i might i might probably do it online i don't know you can do it online right yeah sure can. all right i just want to take some video that's it yeah, no problem let me get cool. someone to walk you up okay so they're gonna babysit me while i walk yes, sir how why is it what policy is that i don't make the policy sir. so let me ask you a question what's your name and badge number my name is don What's your badge number? My badge number is 2650. Right. I know you're so, exercising your First Amendment rights, and I have no problem I, with that I at all. I get that. In fact, if you would like, if you want, we can get an email, and we can submit your information for your public records. That, you that, give that, it to the city clerk. That'll work. That'll work. Does that work? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so the officer is bending over backwards within reason to help Joey out. So, you think this is going to be all kosher and everything like that? No, Joey's going to find a way to make himself look like a complete moron and blame it on everybody else. So, let's continue on, shall we? I'm just curious, too. Do you guys have everybody that comes up here? Do you guys have somebody to follow them around, to, to babysit them? Everybody that comes up, the public? No, because you're asking to go to the third and fourth floor. Everyone that comes to go to the third or fourth They get floor. escorted upstairs? No, sir. They get as long as you give us an ID, we don't have a problem with that. Yeah, I don't I don't have an That's ID. That's what I'm saying. So with that we need we need to get someone. So escorted. because I don't have an ID, yes, I, I I need a babysitter. I'm sorry, sir. I don't make the policy, I'm just trying to help you out. All right, well which way is the fourth? Well the that's the thing. Floor? You gotta be escorted. You gotta be getting up this. So what if I walk up there and then I'll just meet him up there? You I, can it's just get a public to the fourth floor that way. That's so what way? Floor, so what way? To the elevator? Yes, sir. All right. I I'm just gonna be on my way. You can send whoever you want. Well, you gotta wait because I can't send you up there until I get this stand up for you. What? What is that? I'm what, sorry, sir. Let me. What department you work for? Oh, your security. Yes, sir. I am. Oh, I thought you were. I thought you were uh, law enforcement. Okay. No problem. I'm more than happy to help you out the best I can to help you. Out. Okay. It's been established that the. Uh, the stairs right there will only take you up to the second floor. In order to get to the third and fourth floors, you've got to go via the elevator. And uh, guess what? You've got to have a key card to get to the third and fourth floors. But Joey is just so impatient at this point. He's failing to realize this, and he's going to be complaining about it here in a moment because, well, he was too stupid to pay attention. All right, man. But you right. know what? That does, that's not the way it works, man. I'm, I'm sorry, sir. That's I'm not the way it works. Out. So I got to sit here and wait for a babysitter? I'm going to take a look around over here. Yeah, sure. Go for you it. You know? And when I'm done, I'm going to go upstairs. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. You better hurry up on that. <laughs> a little longer than a few minutes later. I don't have all day to sit here and wait for a babysitter. I'm going to go upstairs, dude. Yes, sir. Yeah. I'm sorry. No, yes, I can. It's open. I got to conduct business up there, and I don't got all day to wait. 
They can follow me up there, dude. But you need a card? Yes, sir. So it's restricted to the public. After all this time, you still haven't figured out that certain areas of buildings may be restricted uh, access. I mean, are you really that much of a simpleton, Joey? Oh, wait. I, who are, I'm talking about Joey Surreal Camera, Joe Lopez. Of course you're that much of a simpleton. How, I don't understand that. No, it's not. This guy's a liar. I'll be upstairs. Okay, folks, this elevator does take you only to the second floor. If you want to go to the third or fourth floor, you need an access card, which I did not know yet, and I came to realize it after now. Now, remember, this is where we conduct our business on the third and fourth floor. Come on now, Joey, uh, get your head out of your ass. That uh, security officer tried to tell you on several occasions that you couldn't go to the third and fourth floors without a security card. He even pointed it out to you. Have you always been this inept throughout your life where you've had needed people to handhold you through each and every process of each and everything that you go through in life? I mean, if that's the case, is it any wonder why you can't ever hold a job? Because nobody's going to hold your hand throughout an entire job, especially after you've been trained or you know how to do the job effectively. I mean, nobody's going to uh, handhold you. Or as they say in the education field, go hand over hand. Moments later. So I can go upstairs. You can walk up there. You did just a private event going. I don't go. I'm not trying to go in there. I want to take video of the facility. Oh, you can take a video up there in a second. Okay. I don't have a problem with that. Okay, cool. What about the third and fourth floor? Again, I'm waiting on someone calling me back. How come you need a card to go up there? Sir, that's private. That's the policy, sir. So that's where I can conduct public records, and you need somebody, you need a card to go up there? I'm just curious because I never go through this, and I don't mean to give you a hard time. But it shouldn't be like that, but that's fine. I'm not trying to give you a hard time. I'm not, I know even you're not trying bro. to stop you to do what you got to do. I, I get the First Amendment right. I, have, I, but I People want to see the building in public accessible areas. So third and fourth floor, you told me it was open to the public. I try to go up, now you need a card. That's very weird. I just never been through something like that. Well, come on now, Joey. You've never been to a building that had secured areas and you never tried to uh, barge your way through them and everything like that. I've seen a dozen of your videos where you've actually tried to do that. So quit lying to your audience when you have the evidence on your own uh, YouTube page. I mean, come on now, you dumbass. Don't pull the wool over our eyes or piss on our legs and tell us it's raining. Yeah, and we all know that you're a freaking liar to begin with. How does the public go upstairs? One second, sir. All right, so... So how does this work? So, you know, just so you know, me. sir, the policy is per the city attorney who I just talked to, okay? The second and first floor, you're more than good to go to. The fourth floor... Okay. Due, let me finish, please, sir. Due to that the fourth floor and the third floor is private, you can file your public records by email or by sending us information that you need. You can do it actually online. All right. You want to All know right. how this works? Sir, I'm done. I'm done. Sir. I want to file my public records here in person. Will you just let her go upstairs? Because she followed policy and gave us an idea. But policy is not law, dude. That's, I'm sorry, sir. How can I help you, sir? Looking for MSU. Oh, that's policy. That's not the law. Well, dude, uh, you can be trespassed if you don't follow the policies of the building. And just a question, Joey. How many buildings have you been trespassed out of in the state of Florida? Uh, because I'm curious. I mean, is it in the triple digits by now? A policy doesn't trump exercising my rights and filing my public records in person. There's a statute code 119, Florida State Statute. I can file it in person, sir. Sir. So why, asked, why do you let them and not asked, me? Sir, I'm not here to argue with you. I'm really not. I don't want to argue. I want to take my video upstairs. That's it. Sir, per the city attorney, 
who I just talked to, he advised me, no, I'm not going against the city attorney. That's it. Just because I don't have an ID? I'm sorry, sir. That's What's it. the real reason why I can't go upstairs? Hi. Oh, uh, are you going to go with the what are you hiding up there argument? Uh, well, let me ask you something, dude. Uh, what are you hiding by not wanting to present your ID to get up there to begin with? Because all you've got to do is present an ID to get in there. And you have refused to do that. And, well, therefore, you're not going to get up there. But let me take a wild guess as to why you don't want to present your ID. Is it because, well, they might find out that you have a warrant out for your arrest or something like that? I mean, it can't be that. I mean, it's not as if you're a, uh, uh, well, a felon or anything like that. Oh, wait, you are one. Let the public go upstairs only if you show ID. Only if you show ID. Are you a supervisor? I can't get a, I can't get a supervisor down here, huh? Sir. I don't want to go and marry. Keep going around and around in circles here. I, I'm sorry you're going around in circles. I really, you guys are doing that. I got my orders and I was told what to tell you. Yeah, no, you follow orders for you follow orders for a living. You, you follow orders for a living. That must suck. You got to follow orders from another man. That's called having a job, dipshit. Your attitude right here just goes to show me that you've never held a job in your life. Because every job that you go to... You have to follow the orders of somebody. So let me ask you something, Joey. How the hell do you think this uh, building was constructed, you, you dumb pile of crap? I'll tell you how. It was done by a bunch of uh, skilled uh, people called construction workers who uh, had individualized tasks that they had to be performed and were directed by a foreman who had the plans of the building with him so that way he could make sure that the building was constructed properly. Then you had teams of electricians, plumbers, and other specialized labor after the uh, building was completed to complete the interior. And guess what? Those teams had leaders who looked at the plans for their specialty uh, positions and directed their subordinates to uh, complete these tasks within a reasonable time frame. But I guess you wouldn't get that because, like I said, it appears that you have never worked a day in your life. Instead, you've chosen to be a uh, criminal scumbag. Have a nice day, sir. You got to follow orders from another man. I don't got that problem. No offense to the others that have jobs here. I'm sorry. I'm just meaning, I mean, I mean it to this man right here. But uh, there you have it, man. I guess we're gonna have to uh, call this number and see why won't they let me go upstairs and conduct business? The city clerks is upstairs, human resources is upstairs, all that is upstairs. And yet all you have to do is do the simple thing of showing your government-issued ID so you can go up there. So really, this is all on you because all you had to do was show any ID that identified who you are, but you're too damn ignorant and too damn deep into this order of bullshit that you think that it's a Fourth Amendment violation to do so. Well, dude, you are a complete moron, as well as most of the First Amendment auditing community. Nothing but a bunch of freaking morons. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?